Well, a very, very warm welcome to you on what is, of course, a truly special day in this part of the world. It is Derby Day, a rivalry so deeply entrenched into the history of sport in this land. It divides opinions, it divides families, it divides just about anything that can be divided. The game itself lasts just 90 minutes, but its repercussions can be felt for months and years ahead. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. Well, they call this a friendly clearly doesn't think so oh, in actual fact the way well exhibition match sounds like an easy ozy game of football peter and a picture perfect occasion until the word pride gets a mention and it's likely to have quite a big say between teams that could easily be sucked into an excuse for another feud why let an exhibition match get in the way of that so these two will be going at it very very strongly Got things on the way. So, Jim, tell me this: Who are you looking for in particular here? Well, a player who's learned fast for me is Luke Shaw, uh, a fullback who likes to involve himself in matters at the offensive end of the pitch. Well, oh, that's a foul, and the whistle's gone. It's not taking him long, and that's going to be a booking. What a start, free kick in a dangerous position in the opening minutes. He's gone for goal. Oh, the ball's come loose. Mohamed Salah proving impossible to wrestle off the ball. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Great run on the overlap here. It is quite a run he's making. Hits one! Oh, what a wonderful stop! The keeper really dug out his defence then, a magnificent effort. Massive leap! Decent attempt, but not quite good enough. Now it's Martial. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Wijnaldum goes looking. Decent looking ball. And he's onside. Big chance! Yeah! Looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. was in the strips. Maguire. Manchester United have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. And Bonnie shoots. He's pulled off a fine save. Jordan Henderson simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. Good ball. Allison gets rid without sophistication. And for a moment, you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Money! Oh, that 
almost no routine save. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Shaw. Rashford has brushed off the ball there. And here's Rashford. And he's there to cut it out. Maguire tries to get it forward quickly. That's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. And he heaves it forward. McTominay. Could be a chance here. Bailly with a fine tackle. Hoists it forward. Oh, real danger here. Mane trying to get there. Mohamed. It's Salah! A collective sigh of relief from the defence. Fred. Hardly anything between the sides. And the score is 1 0. He's had a goal! Whistle goes. And there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal, which is very, very tight. Would you review the first half? Well, I think the scoreline offers a fair reflection of the level of endeavour from both teams. I think they lead because they did most of the probing. A little more penetration, I think, should help them get the job done. Liverpool are in at half time with a slender one goal lead. And we are already promptly back on the way. Well, it's been tight, Peter, but I'm expecting things to, to open up now and we get some free flow in football. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run. He just didn't get enough behind it. Come on, e! That has certainly tested the keeper. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. he's looking for dashing forward at pace look promising but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm Fred it's good progress he's made on the ball where to next he's away has a hit and for a moment time stood still Oh, that was great pressure to force the initial error, Peter. It's the perfect example as to why this is a favourite tactic of a lot of teams these days. And the ball's come out. Fine, Alden. Rashford. Bernino gets on the end of it. Oh, shooting chance! Denied brilliantly. Manek is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. <laughs> so.
So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Well, you have to feel a little for the player been taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Tries to dink it in, cuts it out. And the counter is on. Manchester United are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Manchester United are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Mane. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? He came in hard, very hard. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Thiago drives it forward. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. Henderson battles to win it back. It really is now or never. They need a goal, however it comes. And here's the chance to counter. Alex Tellez. Time added on will be two minutes. Liverpool just have to run down the clock. It's Cavani! This could fall. Well, that is asking for trouble. Goes for goal. It's anyone's ball. And that is the end of it. They hung on right till the finish. Liverpool hit it by the only goal. Result, no question, the most important thing, however it came. Final score, one nil. So there it is. What struck you most about that? Well, thank you very much, Jim, for joining me. That brings us to the end of our coverage. So from us both, a very good evening. <laughs>